Hello everyone, welcome to round 5 of AAS Bowl Season 3. Uh, this is Stevie 6 and today I am joined by both coaches from the game and no one else. So we have Jason, say hello Jason. Howdy ho. And Robbie, say hello Robbie. Howdy how. Like it, like it. Um, so how are you guys today? Yeah, uh, the grudge match is beginning. Yep. The one we're both looking forward to. Mm. I think this is definitely, you could definitely title this the grudge match. Alright, right, I'll make sure I put that in, if I can, if I can fit it in the title. I mean, out of anyone I've played in Blood Bowl, I've played against Robbie the most. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Uh, so, uh, who did what quickly? Was you, you chose to receive Jace, and yep. I don't know who has the fame. Uh, that'll be Robbie who has the fame. Cool. Cool. Uh... I guess, yeah, he just wanted to grind him out. What yep. was your plan going into this, Robbo? Um, so I've got... To, um, I'm setting up a sacrificial line, and then I'm putting my... On the wings, I've got my guys to wrestle at the front, because they're most likely to be the ones who are blitzed down. So get get the counter to block up there, ready. Mm -hmm. And defend my... And basically that gives me some defense in the wings. I've got my catches at the back, ready to do... Ready to you know, run where they're needed. And uh, this is my first game for my Blitzer, who's you see on the right. Uh, this guy. Uh, yes. So, the guy with thick furs. So, I'm hoping he will survive the game. Yeah. You didn't level venue. up. What was his I name? Mean... Roman Romanov. Yeah. Because if I remember him. rightly, they're not amazing when you first buy them. No. Not really. Yeah, they're a bit of an odd batch, aren't they? They've got, like, diving tackle and jump up. Along with leap and long legs, but they are moving I mean, seven as well, which is diving tackle isn't bad when you play your elf matchups. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. <laughs> cool. And then, uh, Jace, you put the guardians on the line. And a standard affair, really. Yeah, I guess is what we've seen from you before. You got anyone? Yeah, like it's it was hard to position here because I know what Robbie's team they can jump over my line, so I yeah. tried to factor that in, but it doesn't really matter, really. Yeah. Uh, cool, so Robbie, you can set up again. Do you... Doesn't look like you're going to change much, if I remember correctly, from watching this live. Uh, shimmy a few Just people about. Spread out a little yeah. bit. And move what was a you bit saying forward. before about bringing guys closer here, or having one guy here? Um, essentially, I want one guy behind. Uh, like, I'd normally put like the big guy behind, so it get, becomes harder to... Blitz him. Blitz him. Like, ba yeah. Fair enough. He's very overprotected of his bear. <laughs> I mean, basically, I'm trying to stop Jason just walking immediately straight down my pitch without having to at least think about tackle zones. Mm -hmm. I mean, fair enough. So I'm just moving around players because that's the old Camry play. You need to move your players really first before you do anything. Yeah, because with yours that yes. slow, I guess. The whole, the whole point of this team is pitch control. Let's see if I can cool my computer down, sorry about that. So cool, uh, and it just standard affair of bashing by it looks like. Mm -hmm. Should have followed up there, but I didn't in the end. Fair enough. Oi, oi, oi. Sorry. Um, yeah, shame you couldn't have fed into the other one. They all did their bit a little bit, so... Now I'm just moving the skeleton just to sit next to the bear. <laughs> Sacrifice. Yeah, like I've, I've made a lot of mistakes in previous games where, whenever I've left their big guy open, they just blitz where I do not want them to be. Yeah. And it's a bit of a pain in the ass when that happens. Wow. Right. Start with an armor break. Blitz, right? I think that's one thing I need to do. I need to actually be more aggressive with my Kislev because I keep, for, you know, I've starting to get to the point where I've got enough skills that I shouldn't be scared to throw a punch. Yeah. Again, it depends against the team, doesn't it? Like, against my team, you probably made the right choice of not being too aggressive, because I want you to be aggressive. I mean, me. I want to. I also want to kill your normal skeletons. Like, I really yeah. need to punch them. True. This is where I make my first mistake. I didn't realise that was a tackle zone. Yeah, and it was a loner as well. Yeah. yeah. So I fucked myself twice there, which that really was annoying. I was very annoyed at the time. 
At least you're not in a hugely exposed position. Apart yeah, from Roman Romanov. Moving players for picking up the ball, as uh, you can see. Kemri needs to do. Or just clear up that avenue. Oh, yes, yeah, so you're going for See a problem with uh, Kislev Blitzers. No, no block. Not yet. Not <laughs> yet, yeah, not yet. Can't remember if he gets any SPP this game. I don't remember. Find out. <laughs> I guess he really needs the MVP because I can't imagine him getting SPP in any other way, apart from cheeky right. passes. I know that. Right. I, I know that a lot of the kids left like. Uh, sure hands failing me here for the first time. <laughs> so we're you're going to be turn three before you pick up this ball. Yep. Uh, sorry, Robbie. What was you saying? I was just saying that mo a lot of the kids left like you know guides are like get your blitzer early, and. Um, and score with him. Uh, let's hop over the line. Yeah, uh, yeah. Not much and I can do about that. And we're running out the ball. Yeah. I guess it's really. I would say it's all you've got, but applying pressure is definitely your biggest advantage. Advantage given his low agent movement. Yeah, exactly. Bear gets a punch. I managed to get a one di cheeky one dice here. I wasn't feeling too. I mean, you got wrestle. Yeah. It's not like you're gonna. Kill yeah. too bad. I jump up, I managed to make a dodge here, which I was shocked by, so I just start running yes. towards the ball again. Yeah, jump up being really good there, because you don't waste movement. Uh, yeah, yeah. it's pretty nippy. Yeah. Try another one dice there that nearly uh, Almost. cost you. Yeah, I think I had to. Re I think I spent a reroll on that one, which yeah, was so a bit annoying. You've lost two. Uh, I probably should have just taken the both down, or the punch yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Then I'm just here attempting to take down this catcher because he's strength two. Yeah, he must. Easy to die block, you might as well go for it. And just get him further away from that ball in case I drop it again, which is <laughs> a possibility. Yeah, I mean, it's a what, 75% chance to pick up? Pick up, yeah. 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 But, but uh, the other way to say that is a 25% chance to drop it. Yeah. I think I forget to mark the bear on this um, turn, but then I didn't really have anyone to mark the bear with. Yeah. Unless you get a push with the Tomb Guardian here. Yeah. Can't remember if I did that or not. This is where we'll find out. Uh, so, push on the other side. Oh, you go for it. I think I stay this... when I wasn't meant to. Yeah. I mean, Should've I kind of don't blame you because you would have been a. The bear would have got a two die block on your Tomb Guardian. Yeah, but you'll see in a, in, a, in a moment why it would have been a good idea. I mean, I would have, I would have taken the chance to eat a Tomb Guardian. Not yeah. gonna lie. I... Luckily, I pick up the ball this time and do some go for it. <laughs> you do some cheeky bloody going for it. I mean, he, he needs his movement. Oh no, I was just saying now, your movement six, your average. The oh, there we yeah. go. So that's the mistake I made because I didn't do that. It's now on my ball carrier, which is, uh, yeah. I think it's whacked. Best of the. Uh... Yeah, because he's not going to be easy to shift now. At all. Are you just. Dodge. Oh, no, never mind. I was, was going to say, are you just trying to stop any assists on the bear? I think that was one of the ideas. No, I think your yeah. plan was for when I eventually drop that ball, so you can just scoop it up and score. Actually, to be fair, he's done that anyway, because look, can't yeah. get an assist here or here. I guess you can get it on the other side. I throw a dice here, but this time I don't follow. So the tomb guard. So, so the tomb guard guys guys on me. <laughs> yeah, clever. That was also a wicked animation. The flippy yeah. kick. And then I copy Jason's two going frits one at a time. Nice. Just yep. cheese him, see if it cheeses him off. <laughs> did and it? Now I. But I think it did. <laughs> I mean, I think you came into this game tilted already. <laughs> no, I was. I was just really nervous, honestly. I think everyone's really nervous playing against Jace. I don't know why. Because you've got no losses with like a tier 3 team. Like that's <laughs> fucking terrifying. Well, I like to think I've made good use of what I've been given. A lot of these guys should be dead. <laughs> and as you notice, the uh, Tomb Guardian moving up the pitch. Yeah. Which is uh, odd. Which is, uh. <laughs> it's a secret that we will reveal later. Here's one I prepared earlier. Yeah. My brain, I got confused with the two teams there. It's like, he could leap the ball carrier out. I was like, oh no. No, he can't. 
So Robbie. just doing some cleanups, and here we go. For fuck it, attempt it. Yikes. Gets the six, and Very gets the five to catch. It was a Worst double bit, six was, on the die rolls as six. well. It was, oh, it was beautiful. And it, it was me shaking with anticipation because I thought, finally, I might actually get some SP on a Tomb Guardian. Yep. Yeah, well, you had a look at that the other day of your, your no level ups really. Would you? Well, it's all the SPs on my throw rods. I think you're having a similar problem, aren't you, Robbie, with your uh, catches? Uh, yeah, I've got managed. Thankfully, I've managed to get one of one of them's got two level ups. One's got one extra, one level up, and one's got yeah. none yet. So yeah, it's once they've got dodge, they're at least a lot. They're a lot more usable. Yeah. Goes that one dice. He really wants that team guardian to go down. I really do. I put you there, so you have to dodge away. Fail yeah. that dodge. And I, I guess you just. I think, I, you think you had to leave that because you had to use the reroll before? Yeah, I think it might have been a guy with dodge anyway, so... Oh, fair enough. I don't remember. Right. Listen, throws a punch and walks away. Yeah, because that's the best way to do it, really. Yeah. Keep going, and I think I do some go for it as well, because I'm like, just get up the pitch, Jason, just get up the pitch. You haven't, got, you haven't used the reroll yet. Exactly, yeah. God. It's like so close to that touchline, I can taste it. So I move that skeleton there just to make it harder to... Get nearby. I just realised with four Tomb Guardians, you've been a little bit unlucky that not one of them's got an MVP yet. Yeah. That's literally. That's well, it. if one of them's on two, so if that one gets MVP, I'll finally have a levelled up one. Nice. Also, I realised I said unlucky. Like, considering you haven't lost the game. True. Yet. Just imagine if I did have SP on those guys. Oh. It's, a, it's a horrifying thought. Right, so it's just a grind, isn't it? There's no cage either. It's nope. been very different. If we compare this to like your game one, the difference in play is like, astounding. Yeah, because uh, well, it's just elves that literally forced me into over defensiveness. I'll probably do the same against um, Ollie when I play him eventually. All right, essentially, I'm just trying to. I'm my my. I'm basically going right. I can't get this ball reliably, so let's let's do everything else that's got a slightly better chance before I chance red and, dice. Uh, statistically, every double red dice that's been thrown against my tomb guardians has succeeded so far in this tournament. When like, Martin did it, it's like a pharaoh's curse. Here we go. I roll it. Yep. I have to reroll. Has to reroll. Skull and he gets down, it. but I've got Sweet. wrestle. Yeah, I'm I mean, safe. there was that wasn't like too too bad, Jace. Yeah, like for like for him, be the odds for, for the uh, Kislev team here. Because going for it, pick, pick up, up the ball, going for it out. So much. Did fancy just long bombing it away? Yeah, I was just so <laughs> sad. I, I honestly, I think yeah. I should have. Honestly, I think I, I think I was just. Honestly, I think I forgot about that. To be honest, I could have, yeah. I should have thrown. I think if I'd got my rerolls still, no, I don't have any rerolls. I could have thrown it at the catcher over there. Yeah. Just to think, it's a five up to pick up a tomb guardian. Yeah, I mean, you got very lucky catching it before. That's why I think it should be a plus two to pick up. It's not no, hard to I pick like up it. the ball. I like it. I like it being tricky to pick up the ball. <laughs> Why? Why, Robbie? There we go. So the Furrow's coming in. Because Furrow's a bay. At least it goes straight down. Bang. And then. It's just. Oh, you should have you should have moved the Tomb Guardian in scoring position first. See if you could have got another cheeky pass off. Well, I mean, he is covered by a tackle zone, so. Oh, he is, isn't he? That's a shame. Yeah, side, never mind. Side break tackle. Uh, I'll be quiet. Oh. <laughs> Decided to get him up the pitch that's, 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 to cause some issues. It's a very dramatic animation, considering it isn't going very fast. Like, all right. So, I guess what we got here is marking. Thank you to the bike outside. I believe this is my dodge. Yeah, it's my dodge guy. Oh. Literally saved my ass here. Yeah. I could. Yeah. That doubles roll. Because oh. I think Robbie forgot he had dodge. Poor I man. mean, I had to punch him either way. I was yeah. fishing for a... Like, I don't have anything to counter dodge on my team right now. I don't have strip ball or anything. I'm just wondering if you would have re-rolled it. 
Mate, I'm out of rerolls. Ah, uh, yeah, try yeah. I'm at, at this point, I'm out. I've I've played my ass off to try and stop you scoring, and I'm out of rerolls at this point. Then the skull there, unfortunately. Oh well, it was worth a try. And then I think this was an easy just blitz with the throw right now and push him and run. Pretty much. Yeah. So we follow up and then score. Just, if you hadn't have knocked him down, you would have still been marked at least. But yeah. yeah. That's probably the quickest I've actually scored with a camera I mean, it's team. the most aggressive you played. Yeah. Like, you increasingly got more aggressive through this whole game, uh, whole season. Right, well, I have two turns again. to equalize before half turn. Mainly because I'm fishing for SP for these blooming Tomb Guardians. Yeah. I'm sort of forcing myself to be more aggressive because I need the SP. Just like debating on how to position this because I forgot that one of my blitz rails was off the pitch. Well, now the ball's yeah. in Robbie's Cool, part. literally. <laughs> right. So, what are plans here, guys? What are the plans? I'm going to just try and score in two turns. Yeah, you should yeah. just set it up for Without rerolls. Yeah. I mean, it's a risky play, but you haven't got much else. You haven't got much choice, have you, really? Not really. At all. And and my position my... is just to try and slow him down. I put Fair my enough. bear. I put my bear just a square back in case Jason gets a blitz. Cool. Not right. bad I'm kick. Off. So you just start. You don't even bother getting the ball. Dodge away. Dodge through. Shame we can't really see the tackle zones. So, uh, yeah, where I put my skeletons, I feel was a better place to put them because there was more rolls involved for Robbie to do his cheeky yeah. jump over the line. I, I, I remember watching this at, at the time and being like, "You, you only left these literal two squares, whatever it was, unmarked." Yeah. So yeah, that was literally three two ups instead of like one or two. Yeah. Which is a better defensive position, really. Yeah. Try to my Maybe you could have. Only had three guardians on the line. I know this is heresy, but then, like spread the other one out. Try and get yeah, it's, it's a thought. It's a thought. If you know he's going to try and pull off this crazy shit. Right. So now I guess there's not much else you really need to do to set up, is there? Just try and make sure everyone's the right distances away from each other. Yeah. So I can't get to the ball carrier, so I just have to try and deal with the catches at the moment. Yeah. Oh, that poor bear. Yeah, we did get a few armor breaks on the bear this game. Yeah, yep, there's one That's of them. Another one. one of them. Yep. And I was just like, ooh. Okay. So I guess now what you can do is try and make him roll dice. Yep. Yeah. Dodge and all and that was actually quite close to the injury, so I rolled a seven. Yeah. Or a KO even. But has he got a thick skull? Yeah, hasn't he? He's a croxagore, so... Yeah, he has a thick skull. Oh, okay, yeah, I'd have to roll a 9 then. Yeah. It's a useful bit of kit, and I, I don't see why mo a lot of people don't take it. That's why a thick skull on my skeletons just makes them better than, say, peasants. Or zombies. Well, I mean, zombies have the extra armor, don't they? Yeah, but movement 4... Yeah, like, it's one of those debates really on whether you prefer skeletons or zombies in undead teams. I mean, yeah. I'm completely in the skeleton camp. I, I want to agree with you there. So, right, we've got and that's the mistake I made. I opened pass. it up too much. Oh. But luckily, it didn't come to fruition. Fair. I guess that was just a shame, Robbie, just set out rerolls at that point. Yeah, it was a four up throw. Wait. Which was aggressive, but I had to do something. I mean, yeah, I mean, it wasn't going to have another turn, so. Yeah. Cool, so let's see if you can cover your whole, what, first three or four lines in tackle zones to stop this leap? I think I'll just go for the same layout as I did in the, when I kicked him before. No. Yeah. no, you tighten it up. You tighten up a little bit here. 
and yeah. it requires me to go through a slightly different path. Yeah, I think I... Oh, you just go straight on the wing, don't you? Oh, I just move one square across, and then I'm just going to leap directly over, basically, mm -hmm. between the yeah. between them. You can't really patch it up really well these with this team. Like no, Most teams the, can't really patch it. The best way for you to deal with it would be to wait one wing to force me to run down the other. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like... You could potentially stop me leaping over one in. Problem with that though is I don't have the speed to switch wings that quickly. Yeah, I'm going this way. Hop, hop, hop skip, and jump, then we, and then through. diagonally through there, and we're and we're through. Okay. Yeah, and the same. Same, same again. again. Wee. There again. I think this was once again. There was literally one square to land in. Yeah. I think I might be being overly aggressive here with my leaping, but I know it'll pull some of your play you'll have to pull some of your players back to deal with them. Exactly. And I've got more than and I've got more than t two turns to 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 actually ho stall you here. Yep. So this is it's, fine. It's hard to decide if you want to play for a win or a draw. I think at this point. Uh, like... uh, mine. Uh, um, yeah. Uh, it happens. I, I mean, was planning to... team can. They can pull out of the bag. They, he nearly pulled out of the bag against Genevieve last week. Well, I can I can get a draw here easily enough, but then Jason gets the ball. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's 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 then after that it's oh, that was the dodge. That's fine. I don't re-roll that. Um, um, Pays the price. Good injury. Ah, uh, whatever. It's fine. At He's only it, badly hurt. Yeah. So at least it wasn't anything permanent. I need. I feel I need the re-rolls. I'm gonna have to have a crazy couple of turns. Yeah. To get things done. Right, so corner is just a shove. It's a bit of a shame by Mars there. Yeah, I just try not to. I don't follow up because that's just asking for a beatdown. Yeah, all of the kids that are around. You don't really have the movement, do you, to stop it? Who's that who's moving? Ah, oh, back here. So, yeah, like, again, just. I'm gonna. I should have probably blitzed one of these catchers, but. If I'd blitz one, it would just go to the other. Yeah, I think actually maybe you should have done. And not done the blitz here. Because if you weren't going to follow up, there wasn't much point in blitzing this. Yeah, I think I was just trying just to threaten the position and force him yeah. to do something. Rather than just sit back on the ball. So obviously the quicker he scores, the better it is for me. Fair enough. Baiting the uh, bear there. Can you... Then here we just surround the catchers, even though he can leap out. Yeah. I think you almost have it pretty perfect to stop him, don't you? Not yeah, really but... We can jump uh, and leap. You can I jump can leap, and dodge. I can leap diagonally over those guys' heads. Yeah. And leave that yeah. way. Yeah, and dodge again. It still requires one dodge roll as well, doesn't it? Yeah, but both of those have dodge. And it's two up dodge, so it's not too bad. Yeah. I can't remember what I was doing here. Oh, I was moving people out of the way so I could run round. Mm -hmm. And I'm just moving everyone else first, and then he's going to make a break for it. Hop over his head, and we're off. Yes, that. I know there was the noise effect, but he did succeed. So he leaps over his head. I sprint down, yeah. and I'm looking. I think. And I'm Four looking up for pass. Throw. It's not too hard. It's a decent it? throw. Four Gets up. it, and that's the score, I believe. Oh, what yes. a throw. Needed diving catch, but still. Uh, yeah, well, I'll take that. Throw is a throw. I've evened up in two turns. It's now got six turns to get the ball off Jason and potentially try and score again. Yeah. Which is this no... is where it gets difficult. It's no easy task. Yeah, for either of you. Because you only got six no. turns to score at movement five max, and you've got to get it off mm -hmm. this. <laughs> All right. See what happens here. <laughs> yeah, because I'm on attack, I don't really tighten it up too much because I don't really need to. No. But then I remembered, oh yeah, I need to put my throw eyes back because they're receiving the ball. Yeah. That's a slight mistake I think you made in the first half, wasn't it? Yeah. You put them really far up. I yeah. did, and I paid uh, that made it a bit more. But then again, it helped a little bit because it forced Robbie to bring all his players forward and then. It worked out for me in the end. Yeah. I mean, you shouldn't have made that throw. <laughs> yeah. Uh, made there that goes Gregory. 
And luckily, that's the one less player, so it's down to nine men. I think that's me. my. I think that's my low skilled catcher. catcher. Yeah, it is. Yep. So that that could have been a lot worse. I, and I, I catch the ball as well, which is good. <laughs> yeah, straight onto him, Just passing the loner around. And he After gets this squished. game, the uh, passing catching rate of this team's gone up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it has. <laughs> right. Oh, he's got. Yeah, he's got dodge. That was it. I think this is a cage up moment. Yeah. I mean, he can't really cage all the guardians. I mean, I don't think he even needs the gut. Like, I think you just pull one skeleton from the back, and it's still mm. going to be a pain in the ass. Yeah. Well, I did. I believe that. Oh, cool. well, at least dice. you. At least you have the skill advantage with wrestle. Great man, wrestle you down. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. I was like, oh yeah, never mind. But then again, getting him down, good, good for me. Mm. I can see why people just like. Get, just putting his players on the floor is just what I need, really. Yeah. See why people like to give wrestle to the um, uh, blitzers rather than block because they have jump up as well. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm yeah. pretty sure this is where I make a mistake immediately. I go for one dice, yeah, fail, oh. pays the price, and that's essentially handed Jason a free turn. Yeah, yeah. so then I see that and now I have to take full advantage of this now because I have to be yeah, aggressive that. with my throw raw. That was that was really dumb. Ugh. So luckily, one of those players that are knocked down, I can squeeze my throw raft through there, and I believe I do that. Yep. Try and take down the wrestle guy again. Ooh. I wanted him down because if I pushed him one way, I wouldn't be able to get my throw raft through. Yeah. So I had to do that, as you can see here. And now my plan here is now just to completely put all my players behind his. Yeah, I think that mistake with one dice, I think that pretty much concedes this goal here. So, so I'm gonna just have to, warming I'm gonna players have to play now. crazy aggressive. I, I know that I'm going to have to play crazy aggressive to try and get any players into position to stop this. Yeah. Yeah, so just literally just swapping the sides. That was the plan. Well, thirds. At least so your gonna... blitz is free. I bet him being movement seven helps. Oh, yeah, I forgot about them being movement seven. Yeah. They are pretty speedy. Yeah, they're faster than your catchers, aren't they? Yep. No, uh, oh my god, Fast they are. No, the, about yeah. the same speed as your catchers. No, no they are, they're faster than the linemen, but the catchers are movement 7 as well. Mm. So yeah, fast as a catcher. Do apologise, those two cards were the same person. <laughs> <laughs> Bang. Uh, nice, and then... Who's the bear? <laughs> Back where he, near the ball the, carrier. The glitchy bear. It is. Very, uh, nice. Get away from those Tomb Guardians. This is basically an elf column defense. Yeah, like, I'm trying, but like, I, don't, I don't know if it's going to be enough. I've got quite a few players that are free to move, so. I mean, when your movement's six and seven, you can afford to just delay for a turn to so get some people back. Yeah. That won't help, but you know. I think I just do some go for it to try and score here. Yeah, you might as well. Because that blitz is going to chase me down. Alright, here we go, you know. First one, and second Dos. one, yeah, no touchdown. That's the quickest touchdown I think you've had, isn't it, as Kemri? Yeah, actually, no, I think you're right. Like, yeah. three turns? Yeah. But that was it. because of the, the one die fail on Robbie's part. Yeah, I, I, essentially, did... handed you a, I essentially handed you an empty field, mm -hmm. basically. Yeah. Which, yeah. Which gives me full map control, which is what you want as a Kemri team. Yeah, and then I had to spend a turn trying to scrabble to catch up again. So, mm. yeah, I've got to now try and... Okay, I guess I'm aiming for the draw so now. So, that also leveled up my throw roll with dodge now. So, he gets... Uh, so, he's obliging. He gets, he gets block at the end of this game. I'll spoil that now. That's alright. 
He lives. Yes. Just in case anyone's wondering. Don't you take him off the field now? I did, yes, because yeah. I was thinking Robbie was going to fucking try and stomp him into the ground. Yeah, and that's not, that's not too helpful to Robbie's winning chances, or even drawing chances, losing a turn. Uh, I've got three I've got three turns left though, and I've still got and I've still got a, a number of rerolls, so I yeah. I think I'll just do the same thing as I always do. And just leap over the line and get my catchers ready right. to grab the ball. Yeah. I pretty much knew at this point the fate it was the dice were just in fate's hand. There was nothing really I could do to stop it outright. Yeah, you just all so you can do I is knew mark it just up. be try and position as best I can and let the dice do the thinking really. Yeah. I just noticed our, our timer is up to 30 minutes, and we, uh, which is usually the length of the game on a replay, and we're like, what, three quarters of the way through? Like, a lot has yep. actually happened. Yeah, and there's a... You, as you can probably tell, because there's not really many people off the pitch. Obviously, mm -hmm. more people on it, the more things... This is a very common occurrence in my games, I don't know if you've noticed throughout the season. What, you're not really hurting people that much? Yeah. You're just knocking them down here. Yeah. And, and you know why, don't you, Jace? Oh, because they're mighty blow. Yeah, exactly. These four, while they are mighty, aren't really doing much injuring for you. Yeah. Oh, it dear. really shows. Like, it's so weird seeing the comparison to my AI games. When I, yeah. Like, my AI games just absolutely destroy. Yeah. Like, I had four Tomb Guardians of Mighty Blow by, like, my seventh game in against the AI. Yeah, I mean, you've also been... I dare say it might be a bit of luck if you've got MVP on your Tomb Guardians. But because I haven't been spoiled, I feel like my uh, strategy's improved recently. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, it's no yeah, bad thing. Like the f I've been pivoting on the Furrars at the moment, and it's been really showing. Yeah. I mean, the interesting thing that Jason does here is that he really commits to my catches, which is honestly... Uh, spo spoilers, this is actually what I wanted him to do. Because I mean, there was not much I could have done. Yeah. Well, Roman the Romanov, I think, is Ro the guy you're after, isn't it? Yeah, my blitz are on the wing. I don't think Jason expected me to suddenly get the ball over to him. So I do... Um, now, this this was painful, having to use a reroll on a two-up here. Yeah. But I get it. He yeah. gets the ball. And now, the issue was, if we pause here... If you just pause here a sec, my dude. So I threw that ball. I could have done a going for it and then hand it off for just a three up. Yeah. Which, if I had done that, I would have been able to throw, do a quick pass to the catcher, which then would have triggered diving catch because the handoff was like a four up. Yeah. But with a dive, with di but if I by throwing, if I'd have thrown the ball to him, it would have been a uh, three up, three up because of diving catch. Yeah. Uh. So I, I, it was one of those things where. I didn't know what order to do it in, so I decided I'd do the throw, get the SPP, and then just, I think I just sprint with him and just try and screen him off and hope it's enough. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you, but. Because need, you need level ups on him now, don't you? Yeah, so I thought this would be a nice, helping. cheeky opportunity. Yeah, oh, that's annoying with the bear. And I just start sprinting my catches, trying to get them into position, and I f fall over with a going yeah. for it. It's a very quick animation, but. Yeah, and now it's just down to me to really. See if I can wrestle him down. Oh. The flubbed the free dice and still didn't get him down with free dice. Yeah. Which is fine. It frees up that skeleton, which is what I wanted to free up. Just to you know do what? some I more marking. I can't actually remember what the result is right now. I know I, I know I obviously looked at it when I opened the game. <laughs> and then obviously these skeletons on the left, they can't do much. They don't have enough movement. But luckily I got both my blitz rars on this side, so I can do stuff. And then I think I just try and focus down this player. I mean, it's fair. Which I do. Fortunately, block. Oh, that's it's really okay, ruined yeah. a lot of chances here. But then I realised I was like, ah, I put my player next to the catcher. So it's, I tried to dodge away, and yeah. it didn't work out. Oh. And he gets injured, but. Hey, it's supposed I to be think... P. Oh no, it's not because it's not a block. No, because I dodged away. Yeah. And he's fine. It, so. Not much happened. And then there's not a bad place because now there's a tackle zone on it. So I've just got to now just roll and run to the end. There's a lot of dice Basically. rolling involved. So like two up leap, yeah. Two, uh, three up pick up, fail, fail. Three roll. Here you go. Success. Got it. Dodge. 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 And then you two dodge. go for it. Go for it. Oh. Fails at the end. And KO for the trouble. 
And yeah, that was just Nuffles <sighs> was on my side this game, really. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and then the ball m magically worked its way back, back, back to roughly where it landed when on kickoff. <laughs> Ooh, gee, hooey. That's not great, is it? If that was an elf team, that'd be a touchdown. <laughs> yeah, if you were an elf team. I just don't know. I still don't think you have anyone close enough to us. You might have had some players. If you're an elf team, you might have had some players in the backfield. I could, if I had one more turn. I apologise. I am not re-rolling this. You're in turn 16. Uh, yeah, no, that's fine. Um, I was just, I was just saying, I had a catcher over on the right-hand wing, uh, who uh, could have run over, got the ball, throw, and then basically done a long bomb on like a four up or five up to try and get it up the field again. Yeah, yeah. Like no, I could have, I could have done some crazy rolls in an, a bit in desperate attempts, but. Mm -hmm. You know, there's no real point. Honestly, I you're mean, not missing much here. I think this is Jason just. As you said, I think as you said in the game, the game was decided when I made that pass with the Brora to the Tomb Guardian. Yeah, that that. Yeah. I mean, I I if I'd have been able to equalize that, this would have been a draw. Yeah. Like I was very close twice here at man pulling off some crazy fast turn two scores, mm -hmm. which, you know, the team's not. Like design, you know, it's not it's not excellent at doing it, but I will get eventually. I'll get the speed to be able to do that. Yeah. But yeah. I've yeah. So you see, I got six SP on both Furras that game. Hot damn. I think Which I, think I still did all right there. Like I got, I I think I also got, I got, I earned seven SP this game. So five for my ten. Five ten. Yeah, ten. Yeah. So I'm I'm not too bad considering I lost that. I'll call yeah. that. A, I'm we had quite a high-scoring SP game. For, that's my highest-scoring SP game. That is. Yeah. Obviously, you've now gone to the top. And I, even if even if Emil wins his game, uh, I don't know if he wins, he'll go back to the top. He has to win his game to go back. To but the then, top. if Genevieve wins, she'll join me in joint first. Yeah. Or whatever's got. She'll probably have more goal difference, so she'll probably take the number one spot. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, anything interesting level up wise? You got uh, six. He must have got some. Yeah, I got the bludge. I only had one level up. Okay, so he got Blodge and he's very close. So, one Blitz for us almost there. One Blitz for us a touchdown away, which isn't bad. But yeah, yep, you're two, two Guardians, man. It's two Skeletons, bad. one away. Yeah, what, what are As you, you can see, they got SP, they got Man of the Matches. Yeah. Uh, but which, yeah, it's a dirty player on them. Fair. Do you think maybe now you're getting quite ahead in the lead? It might be worth almost sacrificing a couple of turns just do some quick passes with these guys to each other yeah like if I get the opportunity and it's not gonna like screw me over I'm gonna certainly consider it yeah but the chances of it actually working are pretty slim fair enough uh, did you get any level ups Robbie um I have to have a look uh, blah, blah, blah. He's on no the catch is the same the bears the same hey Roman did goes back though Next yeah, Duke, Duke, it's going to be lovely to have Duke back. That was back. a blessing as well. That was like luck on my side before the game even started was not dealing with a strength four. That was, that was my yeah. doing, wasn't it? It was. Uh, uh, yes. Or no, Genevieve's. I oh, no, yeah, it was Genevieve. Genevieve. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah, no, I've, I've, it will be nice to have a full team again, and I'm all, hopefully one more game away from getting another Blitzer. Yeah. So that will be nice. Like, I've got quite a big treasury now. I've got 120k in the bank. So, either I can use that towards some inducements, like if I'm like 10k short. Yeah. Because, as you'll see in the next, um, when we look at the matchups for next week, you'll understand why. Yeah, yeah. well, I'm on the matchups now, so. Sweet. Uh, you're against. Who are you against? Jace? Oh. Oh, no. I thought I was against Genevieve next. No, I'm against uh, Skaven. Skaven. So, you're not getting chill, mate, for inducements. Ooh, because... No, I'm not. But that's fine. That's fine, might... because that's injury central. It is. That's what that is. And I know, Ash, you'll probably put his Rat Ogre on the line yeah. when he gets one. Yeah. Uh, and then, Robbie, you're against... Uh... Bretonians. Oh, Bretonians. That's not too bad. I mean, it's no strength think... five. <laughs> yeah, I'm not overly worried. Like, yeah, I, like... I think, honestly, even if my bear just sits and punches a peasant every other turn. I'm fine with that. That's yeah. fine. Michelle just needs to get some more peasants. Yeah, he just needs more fodder to feed to my bear. 
Yeah. But otherwise, like the rest of the match will be interesting. Like he's got he's got a lot more skills than I do uh, yeah. on his players, so I will it will be. Yeah, I think I have my catches are better ball handlers than his blitzes, but his blitzes do everything. <laughs> yeah, it's so a issue. I have to be careful. Cool. Um, I'm not sure about my game against Ash. I'm a bit oh, worried about I, it because I love Ash to be runners, but like guard runners are my bane. <laughs> True, but I do genuinely believe he'll be too aggressive, and you'll punish him for it. Yeah, but if, you if know, he controls himself, like. Yeah, maybe. But... I didn't have good luck against Ash last season, and it might come back to bite me again. Maybe. Well, maybe. We see, I guess. Yeah, so anyway, thank you guys for joining me for this replay. No worries. Thanks for having us. And uh, thank you all for watching. Sorry, I think we're all a little bit tired. It says it's a little bit quiet. But... And then, uh, just to end on one note. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It <laughs> was pretty much the uh, summary really... of that game. Yeah, uh, when this, once this is uploaded and people have watched it, I will send the meme video I made to Jace <laughs> into the chat. Because I was very yeah. proud. <sighs> Sorry. Sorry. Uh, I'm glad it's just a if, 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 if that thrower wasn't undead already, I'd kill him. Yeah. It was a surprisingly small amount of fouling going on, actually. Yeah, I just didn't get the opportunity to, really. <laughs> Fair. Oh, but yes, anyway, thank you everyone for watching. Uh, we will see you next time. Bye-bye. Ciao. See ya.